సువర్ణరావు వర్కింగ్ యాజ్ అసిస్టెంట్ ప్రొఫెసర్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ టెక్నాలజీ ఐఐ చండీగఢ్ ఐఎమ్ టే ఐఎమ్ టేకింగ్ దట్ సబ్జెక్ట్ ఈజ్ ఈ కామర్స్ టుడే ఐ విల్ డిస్కస్ టు ద మై టాపిక్ నేమ్ ఈజ్ డిజైన్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్స్ పేమెంట్ సిస్టమ్ డిజైన్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్స్ పేమెంట్ సిస్టమ్ ద ఈ కామర్స్ డిజైన్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్స్ పేమెంట్ సిస్టమ్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద క్రూషియల్ రోల్ ప్లే ఫ్రమ్ ద ఎంటైర్ ఆన్లైన్ మార్కెట్ సో what is the de- how to design the electronic payment system what are the barriers is there how to uh, what are the advantages and disadvantages all those things we will discuss to the today class so the design electronic payment system it is the one of the easiest way payment system compared to physical payment system so the designing electronic payment system Uh, very effectively could implement the key commerce electronic commerce so in the b2b in the b2b business and b2c c and b2c to c then these different types of the business also there these any types of the business very effectively implementing the designing electronic payment system so the designing electronic payment system one of the crucial role to play from the market in the any online marketing system what about the designing electronic payment system here the designing electronic payment systems involve several key considerations to ensure efficiency to ensure efficiency so uh the one is the ensure efficiency and second one is the security and unusability here the essential component and steps involved designing such as a, a system so the designing electronic payment system you know all several key considerations several key components also there one is the ensure efficiency also one of the important thing and second one is the security and third one is the usability so the ensure efficiency and security and usability it is the most important things are most important factor key factor from the designing electronic payment system here uh there are the essential components especially generally here are the essential components and steps involved in the designing such systems so many things should be there first thing is called requirement gathering and analysis users are a requirement gathering and uh, analysis okay what is the uh, requirements user what is the user requirement what is the user requirement understand the need of the both merchant and customer consider factors like a easy of use speed of transactions and support payment methods all those things comes under requirements so the understanding need of the both merchant and customer in the entire online business depends upon the two elements source destination elements nothing but a merchant and customer it is the one of the important pillars any business uh, point of view here the merchant nothing but a you can making and manufacturing and marketing all those things it depends upon the merchant area customer nothing but a needs are fulfilled customer nothing but a uh, uh, service provider is the merchant we can utilize the service is called a customer so the merchant and customer both of them it is very important thing from the uh, online marketing in the e-commerce especially considered factors like easy of use speed of transaction and supported to payment method the user requirement nothing but a main intention of the uh, book the material or book the uh, 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 goods whatever it may be then easy paying amount also required speed of transaction is called speed of con- transactions and supported payment methods uh, in the supported payment methods in the wallets also online uh, you can use the different types of the wallets or uh, other one is the through neft or any transactions or internet or uh, some are in payment gateways are you there we can use those gateways we can paying up the credit card and debit card or any wallets 
ఆర్ ఫోన్ పే గూగుల్ పే వాట్సాప్ ఐ ఐ థింక్ నవీ డేస్ వాట్సాప్ వస్తుంది ఏం ఉందా ఐ థింక్ ఇన్ ద పేటిఎం అండ్ రిమైన్ సో మెనీ వ్యాలిడ్స్ ఆల్సో వేర్ యూ కెన్ ఎనీ వ్యాలిడ్ ఈజ్ ద జెన్యూన్ ఆర్ వ్యాల్యుబుల్ వ్యాలిడ్ నథింగ్ బట్ ఏ వ్యాల్యుబుల్ నథింగ్ బట్ ఏ దీస్ అమౌంట్ దీస్ దిస్ అమౌంట్ ఈజ్ యాక్సెప్టెడ్ లైక్ దోస్ అమౌంట్ ఈజ్ ద కన్సిడర్ యాజ్ ఏ ద సపోర్టెడ్ పేమెంట్ మెథడ్స్ సో ద రిక్వైర్మెంట్ గ్యాదరింగ్ అండ్ ఎనాలిసిస్ ద బేసికల్లీ యూజర్ రిక్వైర్మెంట్ నథింగ్ బట్ ఏ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఫ్యాక్టర్ ఇన్ ద సెన్స్ హౌ టు బుక్ ద మెటీరియల్ హౌ టు పే ద అమౌంట్ ఓకే most of them these two things which depends upon the speed of transactions also required then going to the other important thing is called technical requirement as well as any online business in the e-commerce especially having some technical um, hazards technical methods or technical errors will be getting so remove from the, those things effectively or smoothly done your transaction so the main aim of the technical requirement at the matter is your uh, your system is good okay internet is good or purpose or components are good and then transaction of the data uh, with the help of the wallet or any online transactions uh, through uh, username and password then after completion of the transaction it is a very effectively a, a transmitting of the data source to destination here major factor is technical requirement now what is the technical requirement here define the technical inf- infrastructure needed in the sense uh, much set of the computers much set of the networks much set of the uh, software much set of the hardware okay much set of the uh, gateways all those things for example the define the technical infrastructure needed including hardware example servers okay uh post terminals and software payment gateways or back end systems of completion of the transactions the back end of data history also required okay uh, transaction history also required and network requirements also be uh, network with depends upon the bandwidth and the asset of some protocols and security protocols and different types of the layers okay uh, snp networks are a simple uh simple mail protocol or single mail protocol different types of the protocols are using finally the encryption decryption techniques also there entire is required from the technical requirement once hackers is attacking of the this transaction dangerous of the danger thing in the uh, merchant as well as customer so avoid the technical fraud or cyber fraud remove from your system or, or technical requirements is the more effective part more important thing from the online marketing so the user requirement and technical part it is the very essential thing in the designing electronic payment system moreover the important persons is called one is the merchants and customer merchant and customer also very very crucial role could play from the uh, designing electronic payment system and second one is uh, requirement gathering uh, and analysis then user requirements and technical requirements also required the requ- user requirement at the uh, merchant and customer satisfaction supported payment methods also required and the technical requirement at the define the technical infrastructure needed the technical infrastructures is called a set of hardware like servers host terminals and a set of software is also required software like the payment gateways back back end systems and network requirement and and uh, here is followed by the network requirement is called the bandwidth uh, the electronic payment uh, systems having some security protocols also there here the design electronic payment systems uh, first thing we will discuss to the uh, system architecture design is the most important thing system architecture design here the payment gateway developed are choose a reliable payment gateway 
that facilitate communication between the merchant, customers and financial institutions. So, the gateway should support various payment methods like credit card, e-wallet or bank transfer etc. and ensure security data uh, transmissions. So, the payment gateway it is the one of the crucial role to develop or choose a reliable payment gateway that facilitate communicating between merchants, customer and financial institutions. Then the gateway should support various payment methods, credit card, debit card or any e-wallet bank transfer etc. and ensure security data transfer. So the payment gateway is the most important thing in the system architecture design through design electronic payment system. In the other other hand is called the backend system. What are the backend system in the system architecture? One is the payment gateway and second one is the backend system. In the sense store the information after completion of the transaction in the backend data also required. Design a robust backend system to handle transaction processing, user authentication, authorization and data storage. This is the backend after completion of the uh, uh, transactions you can store the, those data. Okay, is called the backend system. Implement redundancy and uh, fail over mechanism to ensure system reliability. So, the backend system depends upon the, the system will be robust backend systems also required to handle the transaction process also one of the good thing and user authentication, user authorization or authentication very very important thing and authorization and data storage, implement redundancy and failover mechanism to ensure system reliability. So the backend system it is the one of the important thing from the system architecture designs through design electronic process in the e commerce And another one is the integration, integrated the transactions, integrated the goods, integrated the material. Okay, ensure seamless integration with other systems like according uh, accounting inventory management and uh, a customer relationship management, CRM systems, customer relationship Customer relationship systems ultimately is the one of the good service provider from the integration. So ensure seamless integration with other systems like accounting and inventory management and customer relationship account management CRM also is the one of the important thing. And third one is called the security consideration. It is the part of the security, one of the important uh, backbone from the any online transaction through designing electronic payment system without security without security it is the dangerous transaction from the online marketing so security very uh, authenticated and secure security is provided in the online marketing especially any app like amazon or uh, ebay or uh, any online marketing services could provide uh, phone pay, Google pay. Uh, this is also uh, transaction amount payment also is uh, required. And uh, Paytm and there are different types of the uh, wallets are implemented. Here, any wallets, any uh, financial wallets, it is provided with good security. These are the security considerations. In, in the point of the point is what about the security? Security nothing but here. Implement end-to-end -end encryption to protect sensitive data such as the credit card details and your personal information. It is the end-to-end -end encryption and decryption also there. What is the encryption nothing but here? Plain text is conversion of the encrypted. Encryption is converted to the plain text and plain text to ciphertext, ciphertext to plain te text, such type of technique is called the encryption. Encryption, the aim is the uh, estimated uh, data. Decryption mathematics, the encryption is converted into the uncoded, unlegitimate language is called the decryption. We can use the, these two techniques, then forwarding the data is the trace out or introduce is trace out those data is very difficult. So 
one of the security consideration is encryption is very useful uh, thing but uh, don't trace out anyone uh, in the uh, payment gateway systems will not break out anyone so and why because uh, should followed by uh, secure encryption systems is there tokenization tokenization in the sense use tokenizations to replace the sensitive data with unique Q identification symbols unique Q identification symbols is called the tokens are tokenization that retains essential information without compromising security is called the tokenization and comprehensive the other two industry standards and regulations uh, for example uh, a PCI DSS for handling credit card information to prevent data breaches and ensure legal compliances. Different types of the compliances is there other two industry standard to regulations for example PCI DSS for handling credit card information to prevent data breaches and ensure legal compliances. So the security consideration having these three things is very important from the one is the encryption, second one is the tokenization and third one is the uh, compliances. The encryption of the data will be converted into the one form to other form encrypted to decrypt or plain text to cipher text. and tokenization nothing but a identification, unique Q identification symbols is called the tokens. It is the lexemes converted into the those data is called the lexemes and compliances. Other two industry standard regulations, for example, PCA DSS uh, for handling credit card um, information to prevent data breaches and ensure legal compliances. Though, so these three things also most important of the key pay, key points from the security consideration. And another important thing in the design electronic payment system is called the user interfaces design. User interfaces be design. It depends upon the two things. One is the merchant interfaces and second one is the customer interface. Merchant nothing but a design and initiative dashboard for the merchants to manage transactions via analytics and configure settings. All those things, so many things will be depends upon the merchant interface. Merchant interface different than the customer interface. What is the customer interfaces? Create a user friendly interfaces for the customers to initiate payments, view transactions history and manage their payment method. So the customer interfaces is different than the merchant interfaces. Why? Because of merchant interface nothing but a design and in a initiative dashboard for a merchant to manage transactions, view analytics and configure settings is called the merchant interfaces. Going to the customer interfaces to ease or uh, create a user friendly interfaces for the customer to initiate payment, how to uh, payment, how to done a payment, view of the transaction history and manage the payment method. Uh, all those things you can dictate. Okay, you can learn, you can predict with depends upon the customer. So the user interfaces is the one of the crucial role to play from the designing electronic payment system. And uh, another one is the Testing and quality interfaces. Conducting uh, rigorous testing, unit testings, or integrated testings, and security testing to identify and fix a box or ensure system stability and validate security measures. Perform load testings to assess the system's performance under peak transactions value. So, the uh, uh, Testing and usability assurance it depends upon the one of the important things from the design electronics payment method. You are conducting a rigorous testing, unit testing, integration testing, and security testing to identify and fix bugs and ensure system stability, validation security measures. Perform load testing is the assess the system's performance and the peak transactions value. So the test nothing but a whether data is the validate or not, different types of the testing is also there. Uh, then base intention is the uh, testing is called the, to identify the bugs or errors, any mistakes. In the transaction times, anything will be happened, you can remove from with the help of the testing. Why? Because of 
testing one of the testing is called the unit testing unit testing nothing but a one of the uh, basic testings entire data will be divided into the modules or tasks or integration testings nothing but a integrating of the more than one units is called integration testings then after security testing nothing but a those key com components are in a, uh, hiding data encapsulation uh, or inheritance properties or a hide of the information abstract data all those things the key pillars is using or not then moreover in the transaction time those software is effectively working or not you can then yeah uh, testing quality assurance, identify and fix the bugs, ensure system stability and validate security measurements. So the performance, uh, the performance, uh, low testing to access the system's performance and the peak uh, transactions value. Deployment and maintenance. Uh, plan for phase deployment to minimizing distribution, disruption to existing operations, establish monitoring tool and processes to detect and uh, respond of the issues promptly, providing the ensuring support and maintenance to address update security patches and system mechanism. So the deployment nothing but a we can provide the service providers are having some maintenance. For example, we can uh, buy a one product. Uh, unfortunately, not receiving the product. What happened going on? Take out the your transaction data then everything is genuine then return back the lower amount it depends upon the uh, uh, conditions it apply from the condition performance optimization here optimization of but here uh, uh, reduce the garbage information systems performance through finite uh, you know, turning databases optimization for and leveraging catching mechanism monitoring systems may matrix also there responses times and transaction success rates all those things will be there to identify the bottlenecks and areas of the improvement ultimately performance optimization simply optimize okay that is also one of the uh, uh, thing it is called optimize system and another important user uh, uh, education and support develop education and training materials for the merchant and customer to understanding how to use the system efficiently, offer respect and responsiveness customer support channels to address inquiries and uh, issues from issues problems. So the user education support also one of the important things for the uh, designing electronic payment system and feature scalability. This is also one of the important things from the design electronic payment system. Design the systems with the scalability in the mind to avoiding growth in transactions values and the new features. Consider the cloud-based solutions and scalable architectures to easily expand infrastructures as needed. The feature scalability is also the most important thing in the design electronic payment system. Uh, enter those things it depends upon the designing electronic payment systems by following these steps and considerations uh, uh, you can design an electronic payment system that is a uh, secure reliable secure and reliable and user friendly meeting the needs both merchant and customer uh, effectively so the designing electronic systems one of the crucial play could play from the uh, e-commerce business e-commerce business These are the my references. Ravi Kolkata, uh, Wisdom Andrews, B4 Inches Electrical Consumer, Space and First Education, 1996, having different types of the references books also there. So, it makes very useful, special kind of the books or uh, references books also there. Davis Whiteley, e commerce strategy, technical significations, and data migration. 
second edition 2000 Communist K Bazaars e commerce the cutting edge of the business strata of my Grishi first edition. J. Christopher Westland Theodore H. K. Cloud Global Electronics Commerce uh, Theory and uh, uh, Case Studies University Press in the first edition. Different types of the references are also there. Uh, one is the uh, uh, jsu.edu uh, ga o okay uh, j e r r y and post in the cm uh, p 29 uh, 6 u by 29 6 grid like that introduction of the pdf all those things also available uh, very useful data or material also there and second is the tutorial point is the common uh, references and third one is the yes notes from edu okay that is also one of the important things so we can utilize the, those things and could implement them uh, uh, this is also one of the important things from the uh, today class uh, thank you like share and subscribe hit the bell icon for more updates